Well, people in a downtown Denver complex are shaken after a gunman targeted their building multiple times. Yeah, they hope a short video clip helps police make an arrest. The video shows the gunman in an alley near the building and captures at least one gunshot. It happened at the Beauvillon and 9th and Lincoln in the city's Golden Triangle neighborhood. Our Karen Morfitt talked with residents about those attacks. And Karen, at this moment, that video is all police have to go on. That's right, Karen. First, I want to tell you, this is the Beauvillon. It's just across the street from CBS Colorado. You can see the building behind me here. Those residents say they are beyond thankful for the man who recorded that video, who also found a shell casing from a 22 caliber rifle in that same area. Now, I spoke with him on the phone earlier tonight. He asked to remain anonymous until he can be sure that the gunman is caught, but he tells me he was just in the right place at the right time. The video is clear, and if not taken on the 4th of July, the sound of gunfire, unmistakable. This has been very unnerving for everyone because it's been going on for over a month. The man is seen holding a rifle and firing at the nearby Bovalon apartment building. Rounds that would reach the penthouse, nearly hitting those on the balcony and shattering a window. They were on their balcony on the 14th floor enjoying July 4th festivities, getting ready for fireworks, uh, and yeah, and a shot comes like right over their head. Orrin Shrensky is the president of the Bovalon HOA board. She says it was one of five windows that have been hit in less than a month. In June, a bullet went through a 10th story window, nearly striking a woman in her office. While Denver police are investigating, residents have now turned their attention to an arrest in Broomfield. Police arrested Kenneth Fairchild for allegedly firing shots into a business and shared a photo of his vehicle, a gray Prius with blue decals, similar to the car in this video. We don't know for sure. Um, we're waiting for confirmation. While they wait for any word of an arrest, Shrensky says residents are taking their own precautions. We sent out an email, please be safe. Don't go on your balcony. If you do, just be vigilant. Now, Fairchild is in jail tonight. He's being held on attempted first degree murder charges, among a number of others. Now, we asked both police departments, Broomfield and Denver PD, for any comment on a possible connection and did not hear back. But both did say if you recognize that vehicle or Fairchild, you can either call their departments or call Metro Crime Stoppers. We're live in Denver. Karen Morfitt covering Colorado First. All right, Karen, thank you.